Okay, children. Next, we look into the word problems. Okay. Sally plants four saplings. Sapling means baby plants. So she is planting four baby plants in her garden in a row. So one, two, three, four in a row. And the distance between two adjacent. Adjacent means nearby. That is three by four. Distance between this is three by four. Distance between this is three by four. So this is the first baby plant, the second, third and fourth. Okay. And between two baby plants, the gap is 3 by 4 meter. So 3 by 4, everywhere it is 3 by 4. So how many 3 by 4? Yes, 3, 3 by 4. Okay. So what is the distance from the first plant till the last plant? That means the total distance. From the first plant till the last plant, what is the distance? Okay, so what do you understand from that? Yes, the total distance. How do you find the total distance? Yes, by adding, addition. Okay, how many times do you have to add? 3 by 4 plus 3 by 4 plus 3 by 4. Instead of adding it 3 times the same number, what you could do in another way, in an easier way? Yes, exactly. Multiplication. So 3 by 4, how many times? 3 times. So total distance is equal to 3 by 4 into 3. Instead of adding, instead of writing 3 by 4 plus 3 by 4 plus 3 by 4, like repeated addition, instead of writing on repeated addition, just write in a short form. 3 by 4 into 3. Okay. So 3 means 3 by 1. That you already learned. There is no cutting. So 3 into 3. 9. 9 by 4 into 1. 4. 9 by 4. 9 by 4 is what fraction? Improper fraction. So we have to change. Improper fraction. 9 divided by 4. 4 stable. 2 times 8. Subtract 1. So the answer is. 2, 1 by 4 meter. 2, 1 by 4 meter is the total distance between the first sapling and the fourth sapling. Okay. Now, now let's look on to the second question. Here, Lipika reads a book for 1, 3 by 4 hours every day. And each day she is reading for 1, 3 by 4 hours. She reads the entire book in six days. The full book is read in six days. Okay. So how many hours in all were required by her to read the full book? Okay. So here also one day, first day, one three by four hours. Second day, one three by four hours. Third day, one three by four hours. Fourth day, one three by four hours. Fifth day, one three by four hours. Sixth day, 1, 3 by 4 hours. So what is the total time taken? Okay. So easier is, instead of adding it 6 times, so total time is, total time is equal to 1, 3 by 4 into 6. Okay. That is change 1, 3 by 4. 4 into 1, 4. 4 plus 3, 7. 7 by 4. Into 6 by 1. Cutting 2 stable 2 times, 2 stable 3 times. Okay, so we'll get what do we get? 21 by 2. 21 by 2 divided, change it into mixer fraction. So 21 divided by 2. 2 stable 2 1 time. Then 1. 1 is not divisible. 0. So the answer is 10 1 by 2 hours. So 6 days she completed the book. So the time taken is 10 1 by 2 hours. Okay. Next we move on to 8th question. It's a fill in the blanks type question. Provide fill in the blanks type question. Question number 8. A part 
first one provide provide the number in the box provide the number in the box okay the box is given such that such that 2 by 3 into box is equal to answer is 10 by 30 come on think it 2 stable what when you multiply by 2 gives you 10 ok 3 stable what you multiply with 3 gives you 30 ok so what should be the numerator what should be the denominator so 2 stable what, what gives you 10 2 stable 2 multiplied by 5 ok 3 stable to get 30 10 so the box answer is 5 by 10 ok now the second part of the question is the simplest the simplest form of the number of change the simplest form of the number of the number obtained in box obtained in box in box we got the number 5 by 10 is dash change it into simplest form simplest form means cutting whether they can be made it into smaller form yes 5 stable 1 time 5 stable 2 time so the answer is 1 by 2. So the simplest form of 5 by 10 is 1 by 2. Okay. This is the fill in the blanks type question. Now I am uh, moving on to a new topic which is reciprocal. What do you mean by reciprocal? Okay. What is reciprocal? Let's take a fraction 2 by 3. What is the reciprocal of this fraction? Okay. Reciprocal means interchanging the numerator and denominator. There is nothing much calculation. Interchange the number, Exchange the numerator and denominator. So the reciprocal of 2 by 3 is. Reciprocal of 2 by 3 is 3 by 2. Move it up and down. Exchanging up and down. Okay. Turning the fraction. Now, what is the reciprocal of 3? When I say 3, what is 3 equal to? 3 by 1. If any number is written as a whole number, which means its denominator is 1. So, what is the reciprocal? Reciprocal is reciprocal is 1 by 3. Okay? If I write 1, what is the reciprocal? 1 is 1 by 1. So, reciprocal is same. 1 by 1 or 1. So, 1 is the number which has the same reciprocal. So, this is multiple choice question. One word question. Which number has the same reciprocal? That is 1. Okay. Now, 0. 0. 0 means... 0 by 1. What is the reciprocal? What is the reciprocal? Reciprocal is 1 by 0. 1 by 0 which is known as undefined. So what do you mean by reciprocal? Reciprocal of a fraction is interchanging the numerator and denominator. Interchanging the numerator and denominator gives you the reciprocal. Okay. 